today we are talking about Halloween. I've got some decorations to share with you. I've also got some activities because it's most likely that we're not going to be possible to go out and trick or treat this year like normal. So I've brought some activities so that Rose can still have an enjoyable Halloween, just make it a fun weekend out of it. It's not usually a holiday that we do much for, if I'm honest. So this will be the first year, but Rose seems to be a little bit obsessed with vampires, bats, ghosts and all. So we wanted to make it really fun for her. And seeing as we're not able to do very much this year due to the current situation with the world. So I thought I'd make the most of the occasion. So let's show you what I've brought. I will link everything in the description below for you as well. So the first item is this pumpkin with a witch's hat on. It's got some bats on there as well. This is actually really, really big, bigger than what I thought it would be. So it's got this lovely stand with this bow and I really, really like that. It's actually made to go outside, but I've actually bought it to put by our fireplace. I think it would look really nice. The next item that I've brought, I actually bought two of these. Again, I bought them to go on the fireplace. But again, these are bigger than what I thought they would be. So it's a very much similar as to what the other item is, but just a little bit on the smaller scale. I wanted to put them either side of the fireplace, but like I said, they're a lot bigger than what I thought they would be, which is a bargain. So it's, yeah, I'm certainly happy with that. But I really like these. I thought they were really nice. I did also buy a netting to put over the fireplace. For those to go on top of so this is a basically a spider's web it's got some spiders on as well so i bought this from amazon so i thought it'd be really nice for this to hang over the fireplace and then for these to sit over the top i thought that would look really really nice and really spooky and just put a bit of halloween touch to the fireplace so hopefully that will look as nice as i imagine next item i bought was some halloween photo props Rose had some of these for her birthday that she really enjoyed playing with, so I thought that she would enjoy these too, but obviously they're more Halloween themed. I thought, if by luck, I might get some photos too, but our daughter's in the stage of, don't take photos of me, Molly. Uh, so we shall see, but I, either way, I thought these would be fun and something we can use, obviously, year after year. The next item I ordered are some window stickers. I thought these were really fun. We actually have a door that's between our dining room and our living room, which has some glass panes on it. So I thought it'd be a really fun activity for Rose to be able to peel these off and then stick them on the windows. I thought she'd really enjoy that. So they're all Halloween themed. It's a really big packet. These are off Amazon as well. So these were very, very reasonable price. So the next item is actually from Vampirina, the Disney Junior channel. She's a vampire, so I thought it was very fitting for Halloween. So this is just a dough set, so it comes with four dough uh, tubs and then also some um, accessories with it as well. I just thought this was a fun little activity. Rose enjoys playing with dough at the moment and this is just a, a Halloween twist on some dough fun. So I know she's going to really enjoy that. So I did also order some books for Rose as well. So I've got this Puptastic Halloween, which is Paw Patrol. She loves watching the Paw Patrol on the TV. So I know she's going to really enjoy reading this. Another book I did order for her was the Mickey's Halloween. All about Mickey Mouse and the Clubhouse and their Halloween fun. This has got lots of flaps in there as well. So I know that she's going to enjoy lifting all of those up and reading that one as well. Now, the last two items I ordered are more bigger items. So the first one is actually a game. So we have ordered this primarily for Rose to have fun, but it will be something that Daddy will be playing with, and then Rose will just be enjoying pointing to the different pictures on the walls. So it's actually Johnny the Skull, but it's a game that basically projects some pictures on the wall with lights. So we thought it would be really fun for Rose to point to all the ghosts, and then Daddy would uh, catch them or get them with the laser. We thought that be really fun she's gonna go wild and run around the coffee table trying to find all the different uh, ghosts on the wall so she's really going to enjoy that and the last item i ordered is actually a much bigger item so i'll try and show it on screen but it's a build your own haunted house so it's a cardboard house and then you color it in and play with it so i thought this again would also be very fun for her to play with so that's all for today's video. That's all the items that I've ordered. We're hoping it's going to be a fun Halloween and we're going to make the most of it. And uh, yeah, so hopefully it'll be really enjoyable. So I hope you liked this video. Please give me a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks guys.